Good morning. Oh, that's not good. Good morning. 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 The battery is low. Replace the battery soon. Good morning. Oh yeah, sunrise time. Ah, it's actually really chilly this morning. And we are on our way to go pick up our big trailer and drop it off uh, right here in town. So that's all we have for today so far. We've had a slower week this week as it's currently Wednesday and uh, this is our first job of the week. So let's get over to the yard and pick that big boy up. On our way. You still want, this is barely gonna fit in the driveway. Uh -huh. oh, yeah. it, it's a short driveway, and then to have the doors open, you know. Well, let's park it there first. Are you getting out or no? Yeah. Okay. On the so closer to the door, the left side. This way. That side.
All right, let's get those doors open. Well, that way we can go both ways, you think? Oh, what, leaving it out like this? Yeah, just because I, I... Uh, it's up to you. I just don't know on the slip, because that way we can go both ways, through the front door, to the double doors. Yeah, I mean, I don't know if... I don't know if that's going to be an issue for anyone. Yeah, it, okay, okay. Yeah, I mean, if you want to leave it, we were just stopping here to have the doors open. It would to be perfect, though, here, because that way we could go out the front. And yeah. All we're doing is emptying shit out of the house. Okay. I mean, I... At maybe a little bit further back, but we could definitely keep plenty of space open for you to be able to come from either side. So. Maybe like another foot, just to try and straighten it out. And then, yeah. <laughs> yeah, I'll just pull back like another foot. <laughs> yeah, I kind of noticed that right away. Huh? Yeah, I'm just going to pull it back just a little bit. Uh, it's 772-208. It's, it's that number right there, actually. Yeah, 175 now. I highly doubt y'all. I mean, it's just all house Yeah. Oh, no worries. No worries. And let me see. Now I do it, yeah. Watch your finger. Yeah, I'll get it backed up another foot. No problem. This is when I wish I had that jack. <laughs> nope, not yet. If it was a lower madeira, please put no through step. Yeah, let me see. Let me see if this one works. No, no, no. Oh, a quaz. <laughs> no, no. Oh, yeah, yeah, actually. What is the What am I talking Go ahead. Yep. <laughs> Yeah, perfect. Perfect, perfect, perfect. That's good, that's good, yeah. I just wanted to let them know that we already got it. The payment. Yep. Good to go. We're good. I got the payment. All right. 
And uh, yeah, you're totally good. We got wheel chocks on all wheels, so you don't have to worry yeah, about anything. I just, I don't know how they'll bitch in the HOA with this, so. If they do, just give me a call. Right. Yeah. Well, we won't be here, so. Well, <laughs> I'm just saying, so you're not doing the clean out. Somebody else is? I am doing, I, okay. I hired the painting, but I can't, it's his mother-in-law's and she's okay. in hospice or whatever. Oh. So he wants to, but it's like, he paint, hired me to paint it, but I can't fucking paint it because there's shit everywhere. It's, yeah. So I was like, dude, let's just clean it out. And he's like, well, I've been using it. So he's fucking busy. Oh, so if it was up shit. To me, I'd just fucking throw it Dump all. everything. Yeah, but right. He's like, well, I'll come look through it. And I'm like, dude, listen, I'm like, I got a day. I'm charging them for a day just so I don't know yeah. if I'm going to do this. So I'm going to tell you, though, from the exp I I've have limited HOA experience. Yeah. I have had a trailer in an HOA overnight. Yeah. But I've also had other HOAs where they're like, yeah. you can't. There's actually certain neighborhoods not even inside of an HOA that the police department has ordinances for trailers like this. Yeah. Like on Hutchinson Island. Yeah. You can't leave any of these overnight. Yeah. They'll ticket oh. you right away. Okay. But honestly, yeah, cool he'll have my number yeah. as well. It'll be on the trailer. Yeah. Um, and he just got it for Zell. So if he runs into any issues, just give me a call. Okay. Um, and I'll come pick it up whenever, whenever you guys need it. And if for some reason, because I know this type of stuff when it's related to family it could take a while uh it's 175 for the first day it's 275 if it's two days okay so if he does want to extend it for an extra day if he doesn't get too much headache yeah i know i can imagine you want to get the job done yeah yeah of course of course of course exactly <laughs> but yeah whatever you need if you have any questions issues whatever call me text me anytime all right i appreciate you thank you so much Yep. I'm gonna grab a quick picture. Yep, we're good. Good? in the front so good 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 hello handyman yep all right nice and easy drop off simple HOA but you know it is what it is you gotta get it when you can it would have been really a little bit tighter if it was one of these you know on the side streets mm -hmm. but easy enough no big deal no problems. All right, y'all. We're at one of our favorite stores, Harbor Freight. Because <laughs> when you need something cheap, this is where you go. We're gonna look for an, a jack that we can use whenever the trailer is a little bit too heavy. All right. This way. Or right here. Aha, ha. found it right here in the front. Look at that. Then this is the heavy duty 12 and this is the low profile 12, mm -hmm. see? So this one goes 18 inches, see, 18 inches. Same price, different height. Mm -hmm. This is the one right here that I want, which is, yeah, it's right here. So that's the one that I'm gonna get. Definitely this one. But this was gonna be the one right here. 10,000 pounds. And then this one is what? 5,000. That one would be also good enough. Yeah, 5,000 pounds. Yeah, that one I think would be bad. But again, this is still half the price. All right. Let's see how tall she gets. There we go. That's tall enough. No, but I'm just saying, this is more than enough to raise the, the other trailer. Yeah. All right. 
Now we got an auxiliary jack to lift the trailers whenever they're too heavy. All right, now home. All right, so the adventure is not over yet because we just, we were heading home and there's this dog that is on the same street that we're taking. So I'm just trying to uh, see if I can get a hold of him because I've been following him for a little while, so he definitely is loose. I actually just saw a runner run past this way and I was talking to him and he mentioned that when he first ran this way, this dog had run out from a garage further down the road. So let me see if I can maybe coax him over. Puppy, hey. Hey, baby. Hi, babies. Hi, babies. Hi, babies. Hi, cutie pie. Oh, you're so sweet. Hi. Let's see. Let's see. This might be the owner. Good news. We got the puppers. We got the puppers. Hi, puppies. Luckily, I had a... My dad was driving by, and uh, he had a rope in the car, and I was able to get the puppy over here. Right? Right, puppies? We're going to bring you home. Uh, my father thinks he recognizes where the dog is from, so let's go see if we're lucky enough to find the owner. Is this your house? No. Okay. No. I was gonna say. Yeah. No, my dad said he thinks it might be okay. from them. Yeah. So, come here, Papa. I know. I know you're scared. I got you, though. I promise. I got you. Puppies. Let's go see if this is your home, okay? The saga of where this dog belongs continues. <laughs> We're trying to find where this little guy belongs. We're trying to ask anyone that's out here if they're familiar with this dog by any chance. I definitely don't want to let the dog just go. So I'm trying to, trying to find where he belongs. So the guy that I saw running over here, he said that this dog came out of a garage somewhere down the street, so I'm just trying to see if maybe he's from somewhere over here, I don't know. I'm gonna ask this guy here, actually. Excuse me! Do you know this dog? Do you know who... Do you know if this dog belongs to anyone here in the neighborhood? Marcus. Do you know the do you know this dog? No. Oh, okay. No. I, he was walking up and down the street, so I didn't know if he was from somewhere here. Oh, okay. Yeah, you haven't seen this dog before? No. No. Okay. No. <laughs> Thank you. Let's see. Let's see. Maybe this lady knows you. Let's see if maybe this lady knows you. Let's see. Let's see. Hey, quick question. I just found this dog. Um, Does he look familiar by any chance? I'm not really sure. No. Sorry. No, it's okay. He was just walking up and down the street, so I was able to scoop him up, and I'm just yeah, trying to see know. if... Looks kind of familiar. Might be one of these, but yeah, yeah. not positive. No worries. Thank All you so right, much. Thank you. Come on, little guy. We got to find where you belong. Where's your house? Where's your house? Huh? You might be far from home. Because you don't really look like you're very interested in any one of these houses down here, buddy. Where are you from, buddy? Where are you from, huh? Where are you from? Alright, we found somebody that knows the dog. Come on. 
Come on, boy. Let's go this way. Come on, Levi. Lead the way, buddy. Lead the way, little guy. This should be his house. We had somebody on a on a bike let us know that this is this is where he belongs. Come on, Levi. Alright. Let's see. Let's see if this is your place. Would you come, boy? Would you come, boy? Come on, Levi. We're just waiting. Waiting to see if your owner is here. Maybe your owner's not home. I don't know, Levi. I don't know, buddy. Let's see. I mean, the bicyclist is over there. Maybe he's coming back over here to see if. Looks like he might be coming over here. Hey, little Levi. Levi. Oh, you poor guy. You peed on like 19 different things since I've seen you, since I've met you, buddy. Come on, boy. Let's go see what the neighbor. The search is over. We uh, we found someone on a bike, and they saw us walking around with the dog, so they stopped by. And they mentioned that it's their neighbor, their across the street neighbor's dog. So we uh, we took the dog across the street, knocked on the door, rang on the door, uh, the doorbell, nothing. So I don't know if maybe they're not home or maybe they're out looking for the dog. I'm not 100% sure, but uh, no one came to the door. Luckily, the neighbor was super friendly and. Uh, he actually uh, offered to hang on to the dog until he sees that someone actually gets home and then he'll bring him over. So his name was Levi. <laughs> Poor little guy. I really did not want to leave him out here. He looked like he was very familiar with the area, but uh, he just, I mean, you never know with such a tiny dog like that. If he's in the grass and someone's coming by a little bit, you know, little over the speed limit or something like that he's hard to see he's a little dog so if it was some big massive dog and he seemed like he belonged in the area then maybe I would be a little bit more hesitant to just taking him but at that point such a tiny dog roaming around these roads we've had our dog go missing and it was the worst thing in the world I mean we were searching 20 hours a day um, and she's a big dog, so she was able to get really far away. Uh, so, hey, happy ending. We brought the dog to the neighbor's house, and hopefully in a couple of hours, uh, Levi will be reunited with his parents, his owners. Um, so, yeah, thank goodness for that. Let's let this car pass by so that we can get parked up. Uh, ready either way that was gonna be a short boring day and it became a little bit more exciting uh, and we were able to bring that dog home thank goodness thank goodness because you never know once dogs get too far from home they start to lose the scent and uh, I'm just glad he's home or will be home very soon anyway so let's get parked up and our day here is done for now, anyway. We do still have to go pick up that trailer a little bit later today. Well, y'all, as I kind of expected, we got the call to pick up that big trailer, so that's where we're going. We're gonna go uh, pick up my dad, and then we're gonna head over to pick up that 
trailer and get it dumped today because there's still some time before the dump closes as long as we kind of hustle a little bit so catch you in just a little bit all right we're here oh brother let's take a look at this thing oh my goodness headboard <sighs> headboard luggage Da -da -dee -da -dee. Yeah. Perfect. Yes. Yeah. One, two, three, four, five. All the wheel chocks. We're good. Ready to go. All right. That's it? Yes. Yeah, we're good. We're good. I'm just gonna pull it forward and then go take a quick picture of the driveway. Just so that they know there's no damage. <sighs> All right. Aside from a tire mark, no damages, no loose corners, no issues. Beautiful. We are good to go. All right, let's get to the dump. Right, we're on a mission, another mission. We're not going to the dump. We're gonna see if there might be some squirrels stuck in there. Did you let her know or no? No. Okay. Watch your feet, ants. See anything or no? Oh, I hear something. Yeah. Or was it that? 
Don't make no sense. We're gonna throw a rope down there instead. That's the end of that. That way, hopefully, they will get out. I don't see anything down there. No, it's not because I see you. Come on. Oh. The camera and everything. Oh, actually, you know what I could, look, come here. I didn't even think about that, hold on. Bring me the flashlight. I just thought of something. All right, let's see if I can get you a better angle. Let's see. Let's see if we can get a oh. better look at them. Pull the rope a little bit. Ooh. Yeah, just pull it out a little bit. Yeah, one is definitely alive. Change of plans, the dump was closed. So we actually dropped off the trailer and then you saw us messing with those squirrels trying to get them out of there. But uh, yep, have a good day. Good morning. Look at that sun right there. So beautiful. So we actually ended up leaving the trailer over at the yard yesterday. And uh, I just called for an Uber. So my Uber, oh, there's my Uber. My Uber's here, perfect. Hey Uber. Good morning. Uber. <laughs> Cold start. There we go. Let's go take a look at those squirrels, see if they came out. Yeah, it does look a little bit more stretched. Maybe they came out. Mm -hmm. Alright, tough maraki. You think they came out, the squirrel? I mean, it's it's gonna be too dark to look in there, though. Yeah. All right, we'll check it out later. It does look a little bit like the rope is a little tighter, though. So hopefully they did climb back out. All right, off to the dump we go. All right, let's see what the weight is. It is 16,000. Ah. Hey, good morning. Uh, it's like a clean out, so it's like uh, Christmas decorations and stuff like that. It's a bunch of stuff. <laughs> Not construction. <laughs> In the building? Awesome. Thank you so much. Ah. So we should be... Let's see. Yeah, we're going in the blue building. So we're 16,000. So it should be... Uh, 3,500. Yeah. 
It should be 3,600. 3,600, yeah, almost two tons. Let's take the cover off and then we'll be ready to go. Perfect. Get this cover off nice and easy. Yeah, I know. It was just to take the cover off here so I don't waste too much time inside in the way. Is this like an okay spot to do that or no? Okay. In the future though, is there like a better spot more out of the way that you prefer? In here too? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, because I hate to be in the way taking the tarp off up there when the machines have to work, you know what I mean? Yeah. So. Uh, it's got garbage. Yeah, it's like, a, it was like a clean out of a house. It's like Christmas decorations, a bunch of stuff. She told me the blue building, right? Uh, yeah, you yep. Awesome. Thank you so much. Thank you. Yep. He just wanted to make sure that we weren't doing anything wrong. <laughs> Oh, it's very full. Oh my God. How's it going? Far, far end? Awesome, thank you. All right, we're going all the way to the end over there. So, you know what? It sucks going here because then you get the sun in your eyes and it's hard to, to back it up. But we'll, we'll get it backed up nice, nice and easy. I'll go very wide. And then straighten it out. Nice and easy. And then that's it, nice, nice. Take our time, back it up. All the way to the corner, he said. Yeah, the sun gets in your eyes here. It's so hard to back up. Oh, I already, I'm already coming a little bit too far this way because I'm not, I'm not seeing it too well. There we go. Nice and straight back now. Let's see. Oh God, it stinks. It stinks so bad. Oh God, that's so gross. Be careful, over here it's wet. Over there it's not too bad. Over here, oh, over here it's very bad. It's very slippery, watch out. Yeah, oh yeah, 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 I forgot the pin. Better. Station bid. Station T dot. Watch out, back up, careful. It's not gonna open too fast, but it's gonna open, that's for sure. Well, that plate hit me in the leg, that's okay. This side's a lot drier. Oh yeah. Woo! Oh yeah. 
Lots and lots and lots of stuff in this trailer, that's for sure. There's even prescriptions, that's not good. That sound is so bright. It's still going up. Oh yeah, the battery's dying on this one. All right, let's see. Let's see what comes out, cause it's it's small stuff, so it should slide out. Yeah, that battery is totally dead. Oh, let's see. Let's see what we got going on back there. It's gonna come out, no? Oh, there's stuff up there. Hold on, hold on. Oh, shit. Hey, that's the last piece right there, you see? That one's stuff. That, you can take it if you want, no, that hole over there. All the way over. Yeah, that one's stuff. There you go, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh yeah, a rivet gun. Oh yeah, yeah. All right, I'm gonna pull forward again, a little bit, yeah? Yeah, all right. Yeah, I think that's it pretty much. It's pretty much all out. There's a few things that are just getting stuck up there and we can get high enough to, to lower this thing, so hopefully we'll be able to lower this freaking thing. Otherwise, we're gonna be like in the way of everyone here. Just enough in the way while we're trying to lower it, you know what I mean? came down. Yeah. All right. Oh, brother. The stench is very strong. <laughs> Just under 35, I think. Oops. Can't forget the ticket. <sighs> hey, how are you? Can I today? Yes. Oh. Job, huh? How often?
often do they sanitize the blue building? Ah, uh, I have no idea. <laughs> They don't mop the floors there? Probably not, to be honest. <laughs> I don't know, but probably not. <laughs> Have you been in there ever? I uh, guess one years ago when they hired me, but I'm not since. Oh, thank goodness. <laughs> You're lucky. <laughs> I wasn't all that good back then, so. <laughs> Thanks so much. Take care. So she's been working here 20 years. Oh. Yeah. It's a long time. Let's see. Oh look, 3,480. Didn't I tell you just a little bit under 3,500? Yeah, look at that. <laughs> All right, let's send this message over to the customer. Ooh, it's getting warm now. All right, y'all, that was really short. Although, we're definitely going to uh, combine yesterday, yesterday's videos with today. So, essentially, we dropped off the big trailer, found a missing dog, tried to help some squirrels that I hope were able to get out of the, uh, the fence post. I'll have to go and double check uh, later when we have a little bit of time. The rope definitely looked like it moved, so I'm assuming that they did finally wake up from being exhausted and they were able to get out of there, but so morning we took it to the dump and that's all she wrote. Two days work. Uh, hopefully it picks up again because it is a little bit slow at the moment. So, yeah, wish us luck and continued growth. Our uh, small trailer still up in New York. They should have arrived uh, last night at some point. But uh, yeah, that one will be back Saturday. And then we have another another person coming to pick the same trailer up, taking it down to Boynton Beach. They'll be picking it up Sunday morning or Sunday evening and dropping it back off Monday evening. So we are hoping for a few more jobs between now and then and uh just wish us luck and thanks for coming along for all these rides whether they're short ones long ones small jobs big jobs odd jobs all of the above and all of the below <laughs> i appreciate you guys and i will catch you soon peace i won't stop till they hear me now I won't stop till I wear the crown. I swear to God, they don't let me.